Okay, uh, what can you find out about a really quite powerful electric car on a very, very frozen lake? Um, yeah, we're not learning a lot, um, but the guys at Hyundai have clearly invested an immense amount of time in the development of the systems that will support the driver in having fun in this car. Welcome to Hyundai's Winter Wonderland. Our European correspondent, John Carey, recently traveled to one of the coldest places on earth to drive one of the hottest cars on the planet. Hyundai has been testing its Ionic N electric performance car at its Arioplog proving ground in the frozen wilderness of Sweden. The camouflaged prototype you see here has a rumored 450 kilowatts of power and can sprint from 0 to 100 kilometers an hour in a Porsche-like 3.5 seconds. But this test drive was more about sideways action than forward progress. The Ionic's new drift optimizer technology is designed to make the average driver feel like a drift champion. Power is delivered mainly to the rear wheels, but a motor powering the front wheels delivers stabilizing shots of torque when there's a danger of spinning out. Hyundai has also added a couple of techno tricks to make petrol car drivers feel at home. Paddles on the steering wheel allow you to pluck imaginary gears, while a sound optimizer blasts brum brum noises when you accelerate. The experience of driving this car, they have also taken steps to try and uh, engage with somebody who's a, maybe a bit reluctant to make the the step from internal combustion. They've developed a number of, uh, I guess you could call them fake features to some extent. The car will imitate uh, gear shifting. There's a tachometer which is basically absolute fantasy. It's redlined at 7,000 revs, but that's got nothing to do with the actual <laughs> revolutions that anything in this car is doing. Some people are going to like that. Me? Well, I don't know, and it's an electric car. Why can't it just be proud of that? <laughs>